Drop the gun! Show me your hand! So how safe is Tucson, Arizona? Let's take a look. Tucson has a population of 546,000 people that has been rising since the 1800s and is currently rising by around 1,400 people a year. The population is 45% Hispanic and 40% white. Since 2007, Tucson's yearly homicide numbers range from 30 to 65, changing drastically from one year to the next. But the murder rate stayed below 10 till 2020. Assaults, on the other hand, stayed fairly even, ranging from assault rates in the upper 300s to mid 400s. These stats were taken from city data, and some of the data may or may not be accurate. Because the Tucson police released 68 for 2020, 49 for 2019, and 60 for 2018, and show the previous record of 79 set in 2008. Prior to it being broken in 2021, by the end of October of 2021, Tucson had seen 81 homicides, of which the police said they had solved 64, or 79%, which is extremely high of a clearance rate for a larger city. The U.S. average is closer to 50%. By the end of 2021, Tucson had seen 93 homicides for a murder rate of 17.1, easily the highest they had seen in the city. The murder rate in 2020 was 12.5, in 2019 it was 9, and in 2018 it was 11.1. It must be noted that statistics for Tucson change from site to site, and even using the Arizona Crime Statistics webpage, the information is inconsistent from year to year, showing only 80 homicides in 2021 instead of 93, and only 15 for 2022, which is clearly incorrect. The violent crime rate is 80% higher than the national average for the city of Tucson as a whole, which would be considered regular city bad levels. But if you look at this map, you can see that the green areas are considered good, yellow average, and red bad, and the red areas are all in the western portion of the city. The Star Pass neighborhood has a violent crime rate of 442% worse than the national average. Overall, Crime rates are 84% higher than the national average, with violent crime rates 80% higher. You have a 1 in 24 chance of being a victim of a crime in Tucson. Tucson is considered safer than 8% of cities in America, and year-over-year -year crime in Tucson has increased by 9%. Inconsistencies in crime data is not uncommon, especially with homicide numbers. Oftentimes, a city will release murder numbers over homicide numbers as they are generally much lower and look better for a city. A homicide is the act of killing another human, where murder includes a specific intent to take another human being's life. Finding data on Tucson proved far more difficult than most cities, and I believe I provided the best information available. But knowing the information from the state is different than the information from the Tucson police shows that in spite of my best efforts, there is a fair chance some of the data provided is incorrect.